What's good, YouTube? I'm Dewan. Whether you're in college or you're working on a certification exam, oftentimes you'll get these huge books, like this CCNP book or the CCNA book by Todd Lamley that you can purchase in the description below. Now you get the book, you start to read it, and it's just not clicking, and it's just not working for you. In this quick video, I'm gonna show you how I plan, approach, and attack, and crush any exam book that I am faced with. First thing you'll need is to print out the exam topics. Page markers for page marking your chapters in your book. Some highlighters to highlight with. Three by five note cards for your study questions. Notebook, a spiral notebook to take notes with. Pen or pencil. Some vitamins to make sure your brain's sharp. If you guys don't like taking notes, you can get a micro recorder, like this 80s realistic micro recorder that has a built-in mic. <laughs> the first thing I do is I open up a book and I go here. To the contents at a glance, and this will break down each of the chapters. And once I have the chapters, I come in here and I tab off each chapter. And now that I have each chapter tabbed out, I'll start to go through the book. I'll, read, I'll start reading chapter by chapter, highlighting around, along the way. And as you can see, I read the book from the back and I highlighted it along the way. Once I complete the chapter, I go back to the, do I know these questions? So before each chapter in this CCMP book by Kevin Wallace, there are do I know this questions? There's about eight to 10, 20 questions in each chapter. I'll make note cards of these questions. And then to go even deeper in the chapter, if it's a, if it's an exam to where it has labs, I will recreate the labs like this lab here over DMVPN. I'll take my routers, my physical routers, my physical switches or packet tracer if Packer Tracer can get the job done, or GNS3, which, whatever you use. I'll take this lab here, and I'll recreate it in my on my physical equipment. The good thing is, a lot of people buy lab books, but you really don't need lab books because this lab here has IP addresses, and it's basically a, a real um, diagram of a network and DMVPN, so you could recreate this yourself. That's just that. This Todd Landry book. This is what I use for my CCNA. I highly recommend this book. It's an awesome book. A couple things about this book. Like I mentioned before, I open the book up and I go through the contents at a glance and I see what's in each chapter. The cool thing about this complete study guide is that it has the ICMD1, ICMD2, and the composite exam all in one. So if you decide to use this book, this book will work for you. the contents at a, at a glance. And then I'll go in here, but this book goes even deeper than that. As you can see, it has the objectives map for your CCNA. So it breaks down exam topics completely to match your exam topics from Cisco, which is a huge plus. And so once you do that, what I do is I'll go in chapter by chapter, starting with ICD1 part one, and the first chapter is in the networking. And then I'll just start to put these nifty tabs in here. And then we'll go on to the next chapter and do the same thing. And so on and so on. And then your final project of your book will look like so. 